How's it going, everybody? My name is the Game Vortex, and welcome back to Inscription. Uh, from the looks of this, we might be at maybe the end of the game, or close to it, who knows? Um, only this will tell, so let's just get right to it. Your eyes affix themselves on the small cabin. It's warm light, a beacon in the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely... Surely this cabin marked the end of your travails. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh. Wait, am I... Oh, I'm actually... Whoa. Oh, this is creepy. Might be like a secret or something. There's definitely secrets to this game that I probably missed. Oh, Jesus Christ. Jesus. <laughs> scared me. Steps away from the strange cabin, you were presented with an opportunity. I don't offer my boons to just any traveler. If you are able to pass my trials, you will be rewarded mightily. Dude, I barely passed any of your trials. I only passed like one. The trial of the fin. The three drawn cards must include a card with the waterborne sigil. I barely have any. Trial of the Wigged, oh god, oh god. Dude, oh god. I don't have any pelts, do I? We'll try the- wait, do I even have a winged? Yeah, the Kingfisher, right? Do I have any other ones? I don't even- I can't even think of any. I mean, we're gonna- we're gonna fail this, 100%, but... Oh my god, we actually- <laughs> wait a minute. Whoa. Cards that dramatically alter the game, and you don't even need to draw them. The boon of the ambidextrous. You may draw twice at the beginning of your turn. That is really good. The boon of the bone lord. You will start a battle with eight bones. Okay, if I'm still going to keep that totem, I don't need it. The boon of the magpie's eye. When you draw from your deck, you may choose any card in your deck to draw. Wait. Just... Just any card. Like... Any card at all. Um... It's either one of these. It's one of these two. Draw two is really good. But honestly, keep drawing every single card that I want is even better, I think. I'm gonna do it. We will repeat that once more. The Trial of the Ring. If you have a ring, you pass automatic... What? The Trial of the Swift. The three drawn cards must include a card with the sp Sprinter's Sigil. Uh, I have a few of these. I could try. Oh! I wish you luck. Ah, uh, Long Elk is a card with the Sprinter's Sigil success your choice of boons the boon of the forest you will start a battle with grand furs of all your spaces the boon of the bone lord the boon of the goat's blood you will immediately start the battle with a black goat on the board again am I going to keep the totem because if I'm going to keep the bone totem I don't need this but that is really good for the blood that I'm going to need.
I really hope I can keep that totem. Oh my god. You managed to get both of my boons. I rarely say this, but I am impressed. You have been a worthy adversary. But unfortunately, I must soon put you to death. I'm just trying to see if there's like anything to the sides, maybe. Can I go back? Oh, I can go back. Wow. Whoa. Alright. Is it you? Are you the last boss? Oh, jeez. You're... Whoa. You took your time out there. I am itching for another game. Are you ready to play? Wow, I did not ex- I'm gonna be honest, I did not expect you to look like this. I do still have my totem. Oh, thank god I didn't get that, uh, boon. I hope you are adequately prepared. Oh, I am. I think I am. Perhaps one more to be safe. Okay, buddy. Oh, wow. Thank you, Bone Lord. You took the film role. Is that correct? My plan nears its moment of truth. But you must defeat him first. Mantis God! Oh, Jesus. Well, this sucks. My dude's about the... Fucking, well, actually, no, he'll be alright. I think. Yeah, he'll be alright. Are you sure? Oh my god, this music. Uh, I don't know who to draw, honestly. Amalgam? Oh. No, I, th I think I need to save Mantis for later. There there's gotta be more stages to this. I'll draw my wolf first just to be safe. And then we'll go here. Yeah, see, I, I knew he was going to do that. Oh my god. That's fine. Alright, we won one. You capably endured the onslaught of rare creatures, but the true challenge was forthcoming. 
shadowy figures appeared before you. In their eyes glimmered a recognition of kinship, but colored by guilt. They were betraying you. Oh my, oh, wait a minute. Smelly! <laughs> I remember that one fondly. Oh, I lose. Oh, shit. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, no. You made it so far. I... Damn it! Your death card. Beautiful. Though it could use some detail. Oh, man, I was so man, I so could have beat him. Oh. God, man. Oh. Uh. uh. Bad, because <laughs> I'm so bad. <laughs> Goodbye. I'm so upset. I was so close. Oh my god. What are you looking at? Keep your eyes on me. Uh, oh my god, I'm so upset. I really could have won that. Oh, I gotta go through all of this again. Oh my god. All right, we are finally back. Had to go through all of that again with a whole new deck. And to be honest, I'm kind of concerned we're going to lose again because our deck still doesn't look that great. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, I mean, I did get my boy Mantis God back and regular Mantis with Toxic, you know, the, the death ability, so... He's good. I got a really strong turkey vulture. Um, I got the long elk again. I got field mice, which it seems pretty good. But I don't know. I, I still don't think it's going to work out too well in my favor, I'm going to be honest. Uh, I just... Yeah, but you know what? I'll try. I'm going to be a lot more strategic this time and, like, really consider my options before just... Because last time I was kind of going willy-nilly. I was kind of just, um... You know, because I was really confident I was going to win and that... <laughs> Look where that got me. <laughs> so, anyway. The warm light of the cabin cut through the thick fog. Surely your tribulations ended here. Yeah, so we're going through this again. All right. I'm going to beat you this time, DM. I swear. I feel like I was close, too, because I think I beat one stage of him, right? 
All right, we're just gonna go through this time. I really hope I get these boons again. Damn, no. Oh my god, I didn't get any boons. Oh my- oh, we're- we're so screwed. We're so screwed. You didn't get any boons? This won't even be a challenge. <sighs> I swear to god if I lose again. Oh my god, I'm gonna be so upset. Hello again. You're back. Sit. Oh, how I relish this moment. Two flames will not suffice this time. I'm ready this time, DM. I got... Thank you, Bone Lord. <laughs> So I kind of made, like, a blood bone deck. I made, like, a bloody bone deck. That's kind of what I was going for here. Um, so, yeah. And I got a lot of items now, so I think I should be okay. Saw this before. Oh, my God. Okay, okay, we're actually doing really good. Dude, this turkey vulture is carrying this damned moon. It's dramatic, yes, but it provides no value to my board. I wonder. Whoa. He, he captured the moon? Now that is value. Oh. <laughs> Bad. <laughs> What does it do? Moonstrike. A card bearing the sigil will strike each opposing space that is occupied by a creature. It will strike directly if no creatures oppose it. At the beginning of its owner's turn, a card bearing the sigil will pull small creatures like squares into its orbit. What? What is this? Weakening my moon with the stinky sigil? It makes no sense. 
Moons do not have a sense of smell. This is not how I imagined this battle going. Oh, it doesn't have an attack? Oh. Oh, so we win. All right, well, that's the strat, baby. Will the Mantis insta-kill it, though? That's what I'm wondering. Yep. You really destroyed the moon. I suppose all that's left is to finish me off. Go on. I'm gonna be honest, I did not expect to win. <laughs> I, my deck wasn't even that good. I was really not expecting to win that. Oh my, did I just, I think I just beat him. Oh. Oh. Uh. Oh, my eyes. Great video. Oh. Uh. Hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is another pack opening video. Today, I am opening Patch Monsters Box. If you're digging for that epic, shiny Transcend Dog! My ears. We all have some crazy dream life stuff. <laughs> okay, ladies and gentlemen, I am about to open my first pack. Hey, don't hey, don't you talk trash about Birchkin, all right? He's a good card. Next pack. Feeling even better about this. Underrated actually. I got to say these cards are feeling extra silky to me. I mean, they're so smooth. I'm not sure what they're doing down there at the uh, the card factory, but um I'm just feeling good in the Have you felt Yu-Gi-Oh cards? Okay. You feel <laughs> Let me tell you. Oh, yeah, that one's pretty bad. I don't know why. Next pack, here we come! No, 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 leave that, leave that, it's fine. Now, trust me, that, like, makes some quality content there. Uh, you know, I, I was expected to subscribe to this channel, but it seems like I am, so let's keep going. Oh, hey, I know that game. Now, not all of you will even remember this game. I'm barely I know it. to have uh, seen these going around in my childhood. Uh, for whatever reason, they only did one set of these cards, and then I stopped printing them. Uh, there's not a huge market for them anymore, but... Absurd. The got them for, there's not really much reason. No one's even heard of that Mantis said, God, probably. <gasps> Mantis God goes for a couple hundred bucks. Mantis God! See, I told you. I told y'all. What did I tell y'all? Mantis God is the best card. Really cool art on these. Definitely going to test it out. And our rare for this pack is Blue Mage. Oh. Cool looking card, but not going to be worth very much. Oh. All right. Let's see what we got going on in the second pack. Mantis God. Huh. Oh. Uh, what? This Oh, resealed. Uh oh. Oh yikes. Hope no one snuck the rare out of it. Oh, they probably did. You're gonna get like a long elk, my guy. Oh, 
Got some cars going by you there, buddy. There's a set of coordinates on this card. It looks like they were drawn on with a pen. 49 degrees north to 123 degrees west. Uh, I think I'd have to check, but I think that's pretty nearby. Hey, like, if they're actually so, like, inscription cards, can I have some? Because, like, I'll buy some. Like, like not even not even joking. Anyway. All right, you guys. This is probably just a bit, I'm though. I'm out here living my best life. Got my trusty headlamp and shovel. Always come prepared, kids. All right. Whew. What car was that? Whew. Getting close. I think. Was that a skeleton Assuming car? Assuming there is Wait, anything to get close to. This very well may be a massive waste of Whoa. Alright, anyway, hold on. Uh can I go back? Massive Ah, uh, dang it, hold on. And shovel. Yeah, you probably shouldn't go out when, like, a card gives you coordinates. It's a skeleton card. Anyway, that's just me, though. There. Great video. I'll leave a like. Alright. That's why... You always bring an extra battery, boys. Oh, yeah, your extra battery. Yeah, yeah. You gotta come prepared. What kind of camera you got? GoPro? <laughs> See? All right. What's the name of that card? This is it. Now we dig. Oh, I give a seventy five percent chance it's a rock, but only one way to find out. That ain't a rock. It, some say that is where the mantis god lives. They buried him for centuries because he was too strong. What is that? Say, told you. Oh my god, you guys, I can't believe it. The legends were true! There's actually something here. You're gonna get so many views after this. Unreal. Ooh. What? Floppy disk inscription? What Man, I only bought the Steam version. Guys, are you seeing this? I am. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm a little confused. I'm not. I'm jealous. Run, the DM is coming after you. Huh? Wait, I... Wow, great video. It, seriously, uh, hold on. I do not believe that's 11 bucks. Hold on, let me, let me look that up. I'm gonna prove you wrong. Okay, actually, he's not that off. It's going for like, like twenty bucks. Okay. Okay. Trying to figure out what's on this thing. Oh, that was in the intro. Oh my god. 
And then that's and then that's when the game started. Oh my god, it's like SAO. It took him to the game. If he died in in the game, he dies in real life. <laughs> oh my god, it's exactly like my game. I mean, like I said, man, you didn't really have to go out and like dig it up. I mean, like like I said, I have the Steam version. But you know, it's, it's I think it's the same game, but anyway. Uh stop browsing footage, yeah, I think that's it. Hey DM. I do not celebrate often and I sell them some, and I sell them gift gifts. But you, challenger, you are worthy. Please, do not be polite. Dig in. Is there something wrong? Your prize awaits. Very well. Come with me. Stand right there. What is what is that over there to the right? Who gave you that? You absolute ingrate. Uh uh. Oh <gasps> I turned him into a card. Oh, there's the candle over there. Look at that. What's that down there, though? I see something down there. Uh, it's so bright. Oh my god! That was so loud. I can't see anything. Wait, wait, wait. I think I know I think I know what to do. Oh, never mind. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We unlocked new game finally. <laughs> uh wait, no, my deck! My mantis god! Stop, please. Achievement on lot renewal. In the beginning, the world did not know cards. God. I would not want to be born in that timeline. That is, until the scribes, the day the scribes arrived. <gasps> is that the DM on the top, right? Each had their own method of inscription to create cards. Grimora used her quill to inscribe the epitaphs of the dead. Leshy used his wildlife camera to capture beasts. That's the DM. P03 used a particle scanner to copy the CPUs of robots. And Magnificus used his brush to paint the wizard pupils. With the cards created, the scribes had solidified their power. Until one day, a challenger arrived to replace one of the scribes. Well, I... Choose a starting deck to mark your ambition. Whoa! Well, this is different.
The ambition is to replace Grimora and become the Scribe of the Dead. Your ambition is to replace Leshy and become the Scribe of Beast. Your ambition is to replace P03 and become the Scribe of Technology. Your ambition is to be is to replace Magnificus and become the Scribe of Magics. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of liking the sound of the dead. <laughs> I was kind of running a bone deck, so I mean, is it, it's probably gonna be like the same thing, right? Oh, but I might want to do something different if that's the case, right? I don't know. We'll see. The cards were added to your collection. Okay. Well. I don't know, man, but looks kind of cool. Hello. Woof. I was just about to call it quits out here. But now that there's a challenger in our midst, it's back to work for me. I should be able to get this bridge fixed and... Full disclosure, it'll take me exactly as long as it takes you to defeat one of those scribes. So, uh, come back later. Okay. Uh, well, I guess we go to one of these. Oh, I see. So each, each one of these lands is like a different region. So that's the robot dude. That's the magic guy. That's the dead person. And that's Leshy. Let's go to Leshy. I miss him already. Even though he's killed me a couple times. Oh, that's a number, 273. No. No fish, no pass. Oh, that's the, uh, the angler! Whoa! You pried the chest open and found a card pack inside. You received a beastly card pack. Oh, Mantis God! We reunite once again. Revenant, after attacking Revenant perishes. Okay. Oh, oops. Dang nabbit! That dang hound got herself lost again. You think you're getting past? Think again. Not till I get some proof my girl's alright. The prospector. Oh, but you know, this room looks a little familiar. Stop shaking. The only thing you have to fear is your own inadequacy. Behold me. I am Leshy, the scribe of beast. We share a desire for you ch to challenge me. But first, I know what you're thinking. No, this is not my legendary camera. Not the one I used to create beast cards. This one is a mere replica. You may use it to create photos of the beast in these woods. My subordinates, the prospector, the angler, and the trapper. They each require a photo before they will consider battling you. Return to me when they are all defeated. So close. Oh, Jesus, wait. Hold on. Oh my god, I, I keep thinking that's the attack button. <laughs> oh, what is wrong with me? I don't think that matters. The drawer creaked open and you found a pack inside. 
Bitch is gone. What is that? Crockle? Waterborne, also when Hawkle is played, the provided it provides an energy cell to its owner. Okay. Two seven three. You take a stinking pile of meat from the safe. That's probably for the fish, if I have to guess. You wish the trade? You don't, perchance, have any pelts. No? That is disappointing. But I also accept foils. Oh, a stoat. Look at that. Alright. I think that's all we can do here. Whoa. Is that the dog? Well, I'll be darned. That's my girl. I'll let you pass me. And into yonder pond. But dag nab it, first we got a battle. Well, dart it all. Verdeck A right. Get you at least 20 cards in it. I'll have no cards in my deck. <laughs> oh. Uh, of course, Mantis God. <laughs> Ooh, skeleton. After attacking, skeleton perishes. Gravedigger. At the end of the owner's turn, Gravedigger will generate one bone. Okay. Uh, is that all I have? Oh no, I got these. Can't be sacrificed. When Draugr perishes, the creature inside is is released in its place. Well, I need something to like generate me bones, right? Okay, to be honest, I don't want uh Yeah, I don't really want any of these, I'm gonna be honest with you. Okay, I, I didn't, I didn't fully understand the squirrel ball, but now I do. Now I do. Okay, so. Yep. Oh, my boy, Mantis God. Uh. We win. Easy fight. See, that's what I'm telling y'all. Mantis God is like the most overpowered. Oh, interesting. So we gain foils instead of teeth this time when we do overkill damage. Fair's fair. You beat me like a dog. Take this. 
Some say there are here cards are better in gold. Oh, bold man. Very good. Banshee. Banshee will strike an opponent directly, even if there is a creature opposing it. Oh, it's just a flying. Okay. Sarcophagus. Ooh. Okay, interesting. Oh, it's for the angler. Sure. Now that's a fish. Oh. Is there like a green light torch thing? I was kind of just like wandering because I, I, I know there's secrets around here. I just randomly found that. Alright. Fish. Fresh fish. Good. Still. Must be. Okay, didn't mean to do that, but it's all right. Oh, yikes. Oh my god, finally. That lasted so long. You beat, you pass. First, take. Mantis God. Oh, Wolf Cub. That's, that's good. That's a good card. Alright, well. Thanks, Angler. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's a that's a trap right there. I don't want to go go over there. Yeah, go over there. I'm sorry, little buddy. Here, I'm just gonna put it over here because he likes to go over there. It seems. Sorry, buddy. The traitor wanted it. Or trapper. But either one. You have brought a pelt. I am pleased. Yet another turn of the skin and knife. 
it is time to set another trap. I smell the hair's blood on you. Okay, so it's like the same thing. Right. Oh, Lord. Uh, I don't have free blood. Oh, I lose. Damn, I, I lose. Damn. Okay, uh, let's try again. We win this time. I probably should have sacrificed the crow, uh, to get the crow out, do more damage, but it's whatever. The trap is shut, yet the prey escapes, and the trapper waits for the next victim. You've defeated the three of us now. Bless she awaits. Uh, am I really ready for Leshy? I don't think I am. <laughs> to be honest with you, I don't think I'm quite ready. Unless if I make like a full beast deck. Because that seems like the way I can really work around it now. That's as, that's honestly as best as I can get it. You had bested the unhinged prospector, the gormless angler, and the ignomatic trapper. You found yourself standing before your ultimate match, Leshy, scribe of beast. Steal yourself, for my beast will show you no mercy, only fangs. Do not spare your creatures. My camera is waiting to capture them at the moment of their demise. And my beasts are famished. I'll need a photo of that one's cost.
one moment before that one dies, I'll need to capture its stats. Uh, are you serious? <laughs> well, we lose. <laughs> Alright. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna end it here. Uh, next episode, I will try and take out these scribes. Uh, honestly, I'm not gonna lie, I did not expect the game to turn into, like, an RPG <laughs> maker style kind of kind of game but you know what here we are um i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did please leave a like always helps me out supports the channel and i greatly appreciate if you did subscribe if you're new here and as always i will see you in the next one stay awesome everybody